Hi everyone, this is the tutorial on uh, the high school lyrical etude for uh, 2021. So this etude is um, kind of daunting when you first look at it, I think. You see, boy, a whole bunch of notes uh, on the page. And I think you have to keep in mind the old metaphor of how do you eat an elephant, and that's one bite at a time. So what I thought I would do is kind of um, uh, make your meal plan for you with this etude. So let's start with um, the very beginning of it. Uh, it's in E flat major. So remember your three flats. There are going to be lots of accidentals that are changed too, but you need to always remember your B flat, E flat, A flat. It's by first now. It's an adagio, which is quite slow. They mark it as quarter note equals 60. Um, I might even go a smidge slower than that, but I think the most important thing with this A2 to realize is that you need to be uh, subdividing and counting in eighth notes, in eight eighth notes to a measure rather than the big quarter note. There's just too much that happens within sometimes a, um, a one beat even, uh, and it will keep you much more accurate. What you may be able to, after you've really worked on it down in eighth notes, to feel it sort of in the bigger four, but I would for quite a while, work on it in eighth notes. Okay, it also says uh, con, espressione. Con means with, like chili con carne, chili with meat, and espressione with expressiveness. Uh, dolce is marked underneath it, and that means sweetly. If you play with vibrato, I would definitely use it here. I would try, if I can, to keep it as part of my sound through the moving notes, through the eighth notes, and um, obviously the longer notes too. Um, the second bar has a double dotted quarter note and then two thirty seconds and then another quarter note. So if you're breaking down and counting in uh, eighth notes, that's one, two, three, four, and a five, six. The end of the line has something that looks kind of similar except it's a half note and two grace notes. I would do that exactly the same way as the second measure. I don't think it's really meant to be all of a sudden something different there. So I would again count one, two, three, four on the E flat, and then and up on the F E flat, and then land on five, six. So uh, here we go. Here's your first bite. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 